infrared thermometers. How does distance affect the ability of the infrared thermometer to make accurate measurements? The Fluke 62 Max and the 62 Max Plus are handheld IR thermometers. Uh, the 62 Max has a distance to spot ratio of 10 to 1, and the 62 Max Plus has a distance to spot ratio of 12 to 1. So how does that ratio affect its ability to make a measurement of a temperature of a surface from a distance? Distance to spot ratio is used to express the ability of an infrared thermometer to measure temperature of a surface from a distance. Um, the D to S ratio is the ratio of the distance of the, from the IR tool that you're using to the surface that you're measuring. Uh, the might point out here at this point that uh, these devices are equipped with laser pointers. That pointer is pointing to the center of that spot. And the spot is, of course, larger than, than, the, than that uh, pointer. For example, if we had a device with a 10 to 1 distance to spot size ratio, and we were 10 feet from the target, uh, we would take that 10 feet, divide it by the 10 to 1 ratio, and that would give us a 1 foot diameter circle. So the laser would be pointed at the center of this 1 foot diameter circle, and the IR thermometer would be measuring the average temperature of that 1 foot diameter circle. In our graphic, you see that the first target is bigger than the spot size, which is the preferable situation. Uh, the, the measurement area is contained completely on the target. In the second case, the target is smaller than the spot size, and any, any temperatures that are in that area will be averaged in with the temperature of the target. So the rule of thumb for infrared devices is, is get as close as you can safely to make your measurement. 